Once in Italy, I was on the highway and uh, in front of me there was a car that was uh, going really slow. So I passed it and uh, and I heard a noise like a rock hitting my car. So, so I thought, oh, well, a rock on the pavement, or lucky that I uh, didn't hit the glass, so nothing broke. And I kept going and that uh, slow car that was behind me accelerated a lot and uh, went and went really close to me so I let it pass and then uh, it just uh, came in front of me and uh, and hit the brakes so I thought it was like yeah yeah the usual manly man guy who, <laughs> who is uh, very upset about being passed okay yeah you go in front I don't care but then he, he started again like he he really going really slow in, in front of me, like dangerously slow for being in the highway. So um, I passed him again, and uh, and then he just started to come from behind really close to me. So I made him pass me again, and he just came in front of me and hit the brakes again. So I had to hit the brakes again to avoid a collision. Uh, so in that moment, I connected that the stone I heard hitting the car before was actually being thrown by that, by that car. And they were doing the usual scam of the throwing a rock against your car and then telling you like, oh, you hit my car, now you have to pay for damages uh, when they have a pre-hit car. <laughs> uh, but, but it was in the highway and it was really dangerous to stop. So I didn't stop. Um, yeah, so <laughs> we went on for a few kilometers doing like that with them chasing me and then uh, going in front of me and braking. And then when they were braking, I would just uh, brake and accelerate and pass them and they would just catch up with me and, and do this whole maneuver again. So I was <laughs> really, really stressed about this. And um, finally, in that piece of highway, uh, there is a toll booth, like the highway ends and you have to pay the toll. So so in the toll you have to stop and all the cars have to stop. So I just went there and stopped, but but it's safer because there are cameras there and, and so on. Anyways, I stopped in a line and this car stopped behind me. And someone from the car went out from the car and came to me and knocked in my uh, glass. Uh, <laughs> so I opened the um, the glass about this much, so we could talk, but uh, but he couldn't really get his hands on me. And he said, uh, "Did you hear anything?" I was like, "No." <laughs> what was I supposed to hear anything? And he said, "Yes, I think you hit something." No, I don't think so. I would have heard if I would have hit something. And then he said, but maybe you want to leave the car, so, so you check if there is any damage outside. <laughs> and I was thinking, yeah, no, I'm not going to leave the car. <laughs> so so I, I replied, no, but why would there be any damage? I didn't hear anything, so there can't possibly be any damage <laughs> to the car <laughs> when I knew fully well that they threw a rock at me. And uh, <laughs> yeah, so then he gave up because... I mean, the line was moving anyways, and there are cameras there, so it's a bit uh, dangerous to do something. And uh, yeah, so so I paid the toll, and I moved on, and basically they lost me. But uh, just to be sure, I drove like crazy for a while to, to make sure that I would lose them and uh, that they wouldn't continue this thing. And now... I have an important message that was recorded from a professional voice actor. Like and subscribe! And remember, ring the notification bell!